Ignite from dreams to reality. Now, in identifying the idea, you've got to do something first. The idea that you narrow on, you must test it for something. One, Test it within what you really do like doing with your time. So that you're sure that the idea you're thinking about is natural to you, in a sense. So, the idea is good, but is the idea good for you? When you think about this idea, do you think that what you see of it now, are you able to deliver a better service? or a better product compared to what is available around you, then you must test what your competition is. If you test the competition, is it a competition you can take on? Do you understand what I'm saying? Because sometimes, if the competition is so big, they will kill you. Now, let me take you through some technical or analytical tools for evaluating your ideas. There's what is called the SWOT analysis. S-W-O-T. The SWOT analysis. Now, each word of the SWOT has a meaning, and you must apply that to your business idea. S stands for the strengths of the idea. Analyze the strengths, List them down. Always write. Because when you write things and you see them, it becomes more real to you and it makes you think even further. You must analyze, list the strengths. The W stands for weaknesses. Be honest enough to list the weaknesses. The problem is entrepreneurs are usually consumed with the idea. They ignore many things. And they're not even honest in their own analysis of the idea because as far as they're concerned, it's the best thing that ever happened. And everybody else must see it that way. But you must be honest with yourself. The O starts, stands for opportunities. You must list out the opportunities that the idea represents. Or the opportunities that you're able to take with that idea. Then the T is for threats. What are the biggest risks? or threats to your idea. Competition, social threats, environmental threats, legal threats, because sometimes just by changing the law, a business is eliminated forever. That's just the truth. Keep dreaming, keep bringing up ideas, but make sure that the ones you invest the money in are the ideas you have tested the most and they are most likely to become something valuable that will create jobs for our great nation. Ignite from dreams to reality. The Chinese philosopher Confucius said, The journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. And to become an entrepreneur, that journey begins by acting on your ideas. So, whatever idea is burdening in your head, or something you've taken from the things we've discussed today, take what we've learned. Combine it with what you've thought about. Do your due diligence. And if that idea is solid, take steps to act upon it. The nation at this point, with such high level of unemployment, 
needs bold people like you to follow their dreams and lead the way. Believe in yourself. There's a nation waiting for you to happen. Till next time, take care of yourself and remember to keep the fire of enterprise burning across Nigeria. Ignite. Send in your comments, questions, and shout outs to our Facebook page, facebook.com slash Ignite TV, Twitter slash Ignite TV NG, and check out our website, www.ignite-tv.com 